low on data, battling a bad signal, or just in a pinch for internet access while out and about? From park benches to bustling downtown streets, cities are starting to offer free high-speed public Wi-Fi. In Philadelphia, there's now over 78 locations with access, but by the end of next year, there'll be over 200 as part of a partnership with Verizon. They've even got a free Wi-Fi finder map you can access from your phone. We tested it out and easily found an access point in a public park, but there is a big catch to logging on to this type of public network, cybersecurity risk. One example is the evil twin attack. Here's how it works. A hacker sets up a fake Wi-Fi network that looks legitimate, maybe something like public park, free Wi-Fi. It'd pop up when someone is searching an area for free Wi-Fi. When you connect, thinking it's the real deal, all of your data, from emails to banking info, can be routed directly through the hacker's device instead of the city's internet. Here's a few things you can do to protect your information on free Wi-Fi. Don't log into accounts or websites that contain highly personal financial or critical information. Look for HTTPS at the beginning of a website's address in your browser's address bar. The S stands for secure. It indicates that the connection between your device and website you are visiting is encrypted. City leaders offering free Wi-Fi, of course, need to educate residents on these cyber risks. Connectivity is key, but not at the expense of digital security.